Hello everyone and welcome. I wanted to take a moment to go over the recycled materials list that we are using for our upcoming project, which I talked about in class, but in case you missed it or in case you wanted a little refresher, I just wanted to fill you in. So we are going to be doing a reuse and repurpose theme. We did something really similar last year. It's going to be slightly, slightly different this year. Um, but I challenge anyone who was here last year to be thinking outside of the box for something that you have not already made. What we are going to do is we are trying to reduce our waste by using items that we have that we would typically put in the recycling or the trash. And we're going to take those things and make them into something new. So the idea is that you're going to start collecting up these materials now and then when it comes time to work on the project, you will already have them to begin construction. So I put a few examples of recycled materials here on the board. Um, this is not everything for sure. And uh, you can use other things, of course. But here are just some of my favorites and some things that should be easy to come by. So I put on there, my two favorites have the Starburst, a can and a water bottle. These two things are just nice and sturdy and their shape really, really works well for a lot of different projects that you might do. I've also included a shipping box, a newspaper and a milk jug. Other friends have suggested things like glass jars, toilet paper tubes, bottle caps, um, paper that they've already colored on or written on, uh, junk mail that you get in the mailbox probably all the time. Anything that you think might be of use to you, go ahead and save it and um, you will be able to possibly use it on your project. So a few things to note. One is if you are saving something that had food in it previously before you took it, make sure that it is nice and clean and get a grown up to help you get it clean if it's not already. We don't want anything stinky or gross sitting around your homes. And then also make sure because we are trying to do, reduce waste that we do not create more waste by wasting whatever food is inside of that item. So if you really want something, um, maybe ask to have corn for dinner so you can have the can rather than dumping it in the trash. Okay. Also communicate with your family so things don't get thrown away accidentally. We are going to be meeting together in small groups to talk about the project and get some ideas based on the materials that you save. But just start saving. Let me know if you have questions and I will be happy to help. I'll see you soon.